My name is Melila Helner Eshed. I come from Jerusalem. I'm a professor of Jewish mysticism at the Hebrew University and a senior fellow at the Shalom Hartman Institute in Jerusalem. Um, I'm here because my parents came, chose to come in the 40s from North America as Zionist Jews to come and try and build a dream in this country. And I feel that as a child of people who wanted to bring peace, who wanted to bring hope, who wanted to bring God uh, into their life, it is my responsibility to continue it uh, by continuing in my life anything that I could do to bring any kind of healing to this uh, horrific situation of pain that I find here. I also feel that I'm in Sulcha because um, different from many other wonderful peace initiatives and peace projects, there is something that is spirit-based in the way the Sulcha operates. It brings, it brings the Holy Spirit, it brings the sacred, it allows us to meet each other in our bigness, in the place where Shekhinah can come as a helper to bring us together. And I find that that's something wonderful, that there's a project that's both bread-breaking, let's eat together, let's talk together, let's listen to each other together, let's dance together and listen to music together, in order to create what Ali was talking about, that we really experience the other as human, and that we can't, you know, we can't shove them away under slogans. And I think the other thing that's vitally important for me is that I feel there is so many waves of violence that come over this area, come over this land. And one of the strongest things that violence creates, and this is both to Jews and to Palestinians, is that it really closes your heart. It makes our heart tougher and more shut. And uh, what I feel very important about these gatherings, both for adults and for youth, is bringing together Arabs and Palestinians to allow our heart to reopen, to allow ourselves to feel that we're alive again. Um, and I feel that that's, that appeasement, that softening, uh, allows and makes room for, for hope and I think for creativity about things that we, that we could be doing.